Good day guys, it's Jarrah here and today we are doing a video outside so if you can hear kids talking, meh. If you can hear my dog biting in the background, meh. If you hear wind, it's not my problem. So today I got a package which is right here and I'm pretty excited because it is hair color wax. I've never really had hair color wax before and I wanted to dye my hair so I thought I would do this instead. So we're just going to open it up. So as you can see right here, it's just a small little package. Yeah, I got three different colors. I got this a while ago. Ooh, okay. It looks pretty good so far. So when you, I can open up a box, which is honestly a struggle. So I can barely do anything. So, when you open it up, it comes like this. So there's three golden little boxes. So I got three different colours. So we got the blue, we got an ash colour, and we got a violet or a purple. Because I wanted to dye my hair purple when I, oh not purple, sorry, like an ash colour. So I thought I would try that. So we're just going to open up the ash one and see how it looks so when you open up the ash one it's pretty simple it's called hair coloring material by fashion so silver you can see how silver it is you see here it says here after the net hair take a small amount of mud in the palm of your hand circling rubbing uniform try to get your fingers Try to get on your fingers and then gently pull the finger from the hair of the root from the bottom to smear evenly. So, it looks pretty good. It's a one time hair colour, waterable, soluble, non greasy, natural material, fresh and natural scent. So, I'm interested because apparently this has beeswax in it. So, I'm interested to see how it's going to smell when I open it. Because usually wax has a really distinct smell. So, it will be interesting if I can open it. Okay, right, so we got I'm managing to get the silver off but not the plastic part. I'm not great at unboxing things. <laughs> Let's just do this. So we got a little bit of wax on here. So you can sort of see the colour. If it wants to focus. So it's a nice like metallic-y silver, which I'm very excited for. I can... Okay, and here is what the silver looks like. So I've got a little bit on here. I'm actually very excited for this. So it's said to... Oh, it actually smells really good. I just got some on my nose now, didn't I? <laughs> oh. So it feels nice on my fingers, so I'm just going to grab this strand right here and I'm just going to kind of do a bit of the front like that. So I just want to do this small amount and see how it actually works. I feel like you need a lot for your, if you did your entire head. I mean, it feels pretty nice in my hands. I can't tell. I think there's some progress being made. It's not like, oh, actually, no, that's turned out not too bad. I just need to blend it a bit more at the top. But I mean, if you wanted to get your hair dyed and you weren't sure, this is probably a good idea to start with. Just to see if you would suit that hair color. It's a smart idea. That was kind of my initial thought for this, was, you know, uh, when I dye my hair, I don't know what colour, let's just do this. I should have gotten a hair tie, that would have been smarter. So, I don't want to use up too much. I'm just going to do this. I'm just going to use, like, a fair chunk of it. And just get both hands and really, like, lather it in. 
just try and get it all through. Go away here. I mean, it feels nice. It's not as waxy as I thought it would be. Like I thought it'd be like very was glue like. But it's just like, you know, it's keeping my hair together. And it's sort of dyed it. So if I can just <laughs> let's have a look. It's such a weird feeling to have. Cause I'm not used to having wax in my hair. Cause you know, it's not like an everyday product for me. So if I where to put my hair is per normal. It'd be like that. I mean, it worked. I didn't do it very well. So it's not bad actually. And it's a pretty like nice silver. Like I could probably do this to fix it up a little bit. You know, like a really just like really lather it in. I think to get like a full result you'd have to do like your whole head. I'm just gonna fix a bit. I mean I like it. I think it turned out well. Like I said, I could go like really in for it but it does definitely stain so I don't want to grab the camera <laughs> I'm just gonna put this back over you know what? I'm just gonna clean this off I'm just gonna clean the remainder of this lid off and just kind of do this I mean, I like it. Why not? Again, if you wanted to just see how a color would look in your hair, it's definitely a good idea. I just thought this was interesting to me because I'm like, oh, hair colored wax? Like, I've never heard of that. It's a smart idea, really. Like, obviously I didn't blend it properly. There we go, and that's a little bit better. So now my hands are covered in and wax so that's fun but I can't really see how it looks very well I'm just gonna grab my camera up on here and see oh she digging it she like it it actually looks really good I actually quite like it like I said could have done it better my iPod is now covered in wax and that is okay but I was just very curious to see how it would turn out I do want to kind of try the other colors, so I might just do that. So we'll open up the blue one. Whoa, okay, you can definitely see the blue. <laughs> so again, it's the same thing. I hate these stupid lids, but that's fine. We'll just do a quick open. And it's a nice color blue too. So you can sort of see there. I'm just gonna kind of grab. I'm just gonna do this. I feel like that actually worked better. Oh yeah, I like the blue. I feel like using like a little tool would be helpful than your fingers. Especially just to like get it all on there and then give it a full on like melding through you can then use your fingers like do you know what I mean just full on lather it so we kind of did like a speed run of the blue just because I want to see how the color would turn out so again, I'm just going to have a quick look. I mean, the blue's not too bad. 
again I did it like mega quick I am preferring the silver though a lot I don't know so as promised I'll put that back on but last but certainly not least we're gonna do the color purple because that's what we got is the other one so it's again a nice purple I'm just gonna twist it open give it a good old stab we can open the bad boy up so that's what the purple looks like and I feel like we should do this one because we got blue on this side silver on this side I don't know where we should do the purple actually I might just grab the tips here ho oh, oh. ho now that's a purple so I'm just doing it here on the tips I should not have worn this white jumper but that's okay hello Chico I just grab a little bit more. I'll have to try this on my boyfriend, who's probably better for. Whoa, actually, you just have to use like a fair bit of it for it to turn out pretty well. Like that is dripping in wet in hair wax now gonna mix it all through that's a little bit better but like you know we got silver and purple and blue and my hands are a mess <laughs> so that is the hair wax all of them smell great they feel great it's not too waxy it's actually pretty good and you know wash that with water Obviously, I didn't use it a hundred percent how you're supposed to use it. I just kind of slapped it on there, but I mean, pretty damn good results though, even for just mucking around with it. So, let me know in the comments below and tell me what color do you think suits me best? Do you think the purple, the silver, or the blue? I personally am liking the silver more, but again, so we got purple, we got silver, and we got the blue. Boom. Anyway, dry it says in the next video. Whoop, sarcasm out. I have wax everywhere. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. Whoosh. I now have to turn off the camera without getting wax all over it.